Flag up. Gates crash open. And they're racing away. Future Pearl, a little bit sluggish. Puerto Manzano, Hamdinger from deep draws will drop in. Dave the King gets out, gets over to the lead with Lady of Power chasing in the early stages. Melech races away in third and then Bingwa at the fence shares that spot. Meridius at the outside of Cousin Casey and Eye of the Prophet. Only race about five lengths off the leader. Then comes Winchester Mansion just fighting for his head. He's a bit over eager. Bless my stars. Alongside him, Porto Manzano. No luck at this stage. Trapped out three deep without cover. Shoemaker next best. They followed by second base. Safe passage all in a group. Marigold Hotel. Hamdinger is one from last and Future Pearl races at the end of the field as they work their way towards the final 800 metres. Dave the King doing Dave the King things. In front by two lengths and stretching them out. Lady of Power sits in second, white sleeves and orange cap. Then the two-time defending champion of the charity mile, Bing was at the fence next, then comes Meridius, Eye of the Prophet further back, Shoemaker, Winchester Mansion, bless my stars, Puerto Manzano out after those, then comes Safe Passage and second base, and then I'll reach the final 450, and Dave the King shot clear, Dave the King's got a commanding five length lead, Cousin Casey is second, then comes Melech, Bingwa next best, Winchester Mansion blue and white to the outside as Puerto Manzano, then comes Meridius, Dave the King 250 out, has Cousin Casey to deal with, has Puerto Manzano to deal with, has Winchester Mansion to deal with. Puerto Manzano, Bingwa to the outside. Cousin Casey whacking away. Puerto Manzano has absolutely got a love affair with Turfentine. Puerto Manzano wins from Cousin Casey. Bless my stars. Big run Winchester Mansion in behind. But Puerto Manzano, the runs here, the big runs. Winchester Mansion. Bless my stars. Cousin Casey. Melech. But the biggest run comes from the winner. It's easy to tell you that a winner's run the biggest race, but go watch why. From that draw, I've not seen Gavin Lorena be three deep too often here at Turfentine Racecourse, but it's horse, desire, will to win, a love affair with Turfentine, and more silverware for Puerto Manzano. All right, welcome back to the winner's enclosure. And I tell you, the parade ring came alive when Porto Manzano hit the front at about the 150s, just so gutsy. Whatever you throw at Porto Manzano, he's gonna deliver. He had to do it the hard way today from what looked to be a tricky draw. And you can only think, come the Betway Summer Cup on the 25th of November, he could be very hard to beat. Well done to Johan Janza van Fieren, well done to Gavin Larina, of course to Lawrence Werners and his entire family. We'll speak to Ant and then Sarda, the winning charity. I'll speak to Steve Lurkey in just a moment, but this is going to change their lives in a big way. Kev, I've got to say well done to you. Firstly, before we talk about Porto Manzano, uh, let's talk a bit about the charity, Sada. Um, it's always great these days to give back to the underprivileged, and I have no doubt that this money is going to go a long way. Yes, uh, big well done to Sada. Um, it's great that they're associated with Pieto. I mean, he's a champion and they do so much for their charity. So well done to all of them and to, uh, to Allied Steel Road, to Mr. Chada, to Vaughan Rippen. They've just done an amazing job. And uh, what they've done for people today, for 21 charities, it's out of this world. And uh, big blessings to them. Well done to them for, for putting this all together. Kev, look, there's no doubt that life was going to be tough from that draw. Trip too short, he would have needed the run. Uh, but going through the 300, you must have really had a big smile on your face because he's just so gutsy and he keeps grinding. Yeah, it was a great win today, Brand. Uh, look, I don't think we had him at his, at his peak today. Um, you know, hopefully he's going to peak on Summer Cup Day. So I think it was a fantastic win from him. I felt that last 100 that he, that he had enough under me. But uh, the horse that he is, he had the heart to, to keep going. And uh, just a phenomenal win. Well done to Jan and the whole team, to Carl, to Diego, who does a lot of work, um, and to his groom, Lawrence. Lawrence loves his horse. He eats, drinks, and sleeps Pietro Manzano. So well done to Lawrence. Yeah, Lawrence for Lawrence. Um, that's obviously a big thing, but we'll speak to Lawrence in a moment. Gav, uh, tell me a little bit about his preparation because this is a perfect um, way to go into the Betway Summer Cup, which happens on the 25th of November. He'll be better over 2,000. Yeah, definitely better over 2,000. And if your hand can pull a draw next time, it might help us a bit. 
<laughs> yeah, we'll be hoping from his side. And then conditions, Gav, I have to speak to you about conditions because all of a sudden it turned for the worst turning for home and it looked to be a strong headwind. Very strong headwind, Brandon. I think it fell into my hands quite a bit. I was, I was pretty pleased when the wind picked up. Um, yeah, but it, it was all meant for him today. Well done to Mr. Werners. I hope he's having a great time in France. And uh, to the family, to Jared, to Tessa, to the whole family, well done to all of them. Well done, Gav. Thank you. And Volkebos Drift and Mertzfontein, thank you very much. Super. Sure. There we go. That's Gavin Larina. Lovely to have Gavin here. You'll be getting another trophy. Thanks to Vixa as well, who's behind the camera. And um, she'll be very proud of her husband, there's no doubt. Well done to Gavin Larina. There's a nice hug from Arun Chada. What they've done for today's race day is unbelievable. Johan, go you biscuit. Congratulations. Oh, biscuit. Obviously, he's a horse that's very close to your heart. I mean, at some stage, you think, when are you going to stop? Because you throw him against some youngsters that are improving, and he's still beating them. Yeah, listen, um, after Durban last year, he came back to Turf and Dean. We gave him a month in the paddock. Started working him. Um, he's always been a niggly horse. Never been an unsound horse, but he's always had niggles. And um, you know, when we started working him, he's been really sound the last couple of months. And um, I phoned Lawrence a couple of months ago. I said, Lawrence, I think this horse is better than he was last year. But you can't say things like that to people because if it doesn't work out, you look like an absolute fool. But I promise you, this horse is better than what he was last year. I was so super confident for this race before the draws last week, and then unfortunately I had to go stand up and go um, draw 16, and the guys were never worried about it, I was worried. I said to them before, I promise you, if we get a good draw with this horse, and I can sit in the right place, I promise you we won't lose this race this year. Um, but listen, he's just a great horse. He's, he takes it all in, you saw him. Yeah, he's sleeping when we're saddling him. Um, well done to Lawrence, our owner, and his family, and Jared and all his mates, and well done to Lawrence, my groom. He loves this horse probably more than what I love him. But um, yeah, listen, Justin from Marco found this horse. It's just thank you to everybody. I, there's no more things to say. I mean, he's won enough big races, and um, he's just a superb horse, absolute great animal. Will you have another run into the Betway Summer Cup? Definitely not. Straight in? Straight in four weeks, yeah. All right, and 2,000 meters, that's going to be right up his alley. Well, listen, we're going to get a penalty for, the, for a mile today, so we probably, um, yeah, top weight is 60. They can't carry more than 60. So, oh, you know what, irrelevant. Let's get a nice draw. Let those pull up. Oh, that's more important. We want a big one today. Let's celebrate. Let's celebrate what we got. And thanks, thank you to Arun and, and, and Vaughan. And listen, it's our third charity mile. We love, it's not my money, so I thank them for giving the money to the charity. And listen, fantastic, just wonderful day. It's just, I, I don't know actually what to say. Just feels so good. Last word. Your other horse run a cracker, Bingwa. Yeah, Bingwa, we've had a problem with him coming out the gates recently, and I asked Manga to ping him. Um, so, yeah, I would have liked to be maybe a length further back because they were going very, very hard. I think that actually suited Pierre Manzano. So, listen, one man's dead is another man's bread, but um, it is what it is. He ran an absolute cracker. Well done, Johan. You're going to get a nice awesome. trophy. Fabulous. Thank you very Super. much. I know this means a lot to Johan Jansa van Fieren. It's another trophy and another big hug from Arun Chada. Congratulations. We're going to grab Ant in just a moment. He's waiting in the wings. He will represent Lawrence, who's in France at the moment. He will be going to the Rugby World Cup final. Ant, if you can come and join me. My turn to say step into my office. Well done. That's Thank magnificent. You. He's just a wonderful horse. Really, yes. Um, Johan said he was well, so we expected a decent enough run. We all, uh, you can hear my voice is going. We were screaming Gavin home from the 400. We could see that the pace was on and would suit the horse. So very well done. Very well prepared by Johan. Um, I think Gavin's won the charity mile for us three years in a row now. So next year, if you see Gavin riding uh, have horse, a horse, have a bet on Gavin. Yeah. Very well done to Lawrence. Lawrence, we told you we'd bring home the bacon. Uh, enjoy the rugby. All of the very best. And uh, yeah, Johan, Gavin, and uh, Lawrence. There we go. And very Try well said. Better. No, you know what? He's and a, to he's a smart Sada horse. Center, the charity right. that uh, wins the, the, the charity, cash. the cash. Very well done to them, and I uh, hope they use it uh, wisely. And if you don't mind, we've got some beautiful trophies. You might just need a bit of help. Um, that's what Jared's here. He's well done, Jack. Good to see you. <laughs> Haven't seen you for a while. I thought you'd be at the rugby, but he's here for Porto Manzano. There's some two beautiful trophies that will be going into the cabinet of Lawrence Werner's Johan Janse van Fieren and of course uh, Gavin Larina. What a combination, what a team. I wonder if we can speak to Mr. Chudder quickly because again I'm going to say it, what you guys have done today is spectacular. And for my friend Lawrence to win it, it's, I'm, I'm delighted. It's like me winning it. Thank you very much again Thank Mr. Chudder. All right, um, we're going to speak to Lawrence. 
Lawrence for Lawrence, well done. I know you look after this horse. He's an absolute joy in your life. You're going to get a trophy and you're going to get 1,500 Rand. Well done. Yeah, thanks. Thank you very much. I want to thank for my boss, for my trainer, and everyone back to home. It's love to work with me, especially to my eight boys. It's love to work with me. Thank you very much. Go the Boca. Sorry? Say go the Boca. Go the Boca. Yeah, your biscuits. All right, there we go. Well done, Sir Lawrence. Lovely to get that 1,500 Rand and, of course, the trophy, which will go a long way. Thanks to Arun Chada. Gabs, are we going to have a word with you? It's been a wonderful day. I know the weather hasn't quite played part, but um, ultimately we've been treated to some magnificent racing. We have, Brandon. It's been absolutely incredible. Uh, this day holds a very special place in uh, Four Racing's heart because of uh, what charities receive. A special thank you to Arun Chada and Warren Rippon from Allied Steel Road. And then again, just um, well done to everyone concerned. It's been a really big job trying to get this front parade ring going. The team have worked tirelessly through the evenings. I think it's brought a magnificent vibe back to racing. I haven't experienced the atmosphere like this for a very long time, especially at Turfentine. So it's been incredible. Um, so well done to the entire team. Thanks to all the stakeholders that have been patient. And I think the, the future looks really exciting. The racing itself has been superb. I mean, we've witnessed two superb races. I mean, Main Defender and Sandringham Summit, that's one for the record books. And a horse called Porto Manzano, absolutely phenomenal what this horse has been able to achieve in his career. To win a Summer Cup, a Champions Challenge, and then back it up with a charity Miley Sensational. It's a brilliant training feat from Johan, and well done to Lawrence and Jared. Um, they put a lot into the game, and I'm sure they really do enjoy the success when they get a good horse. But uh, well done to everyone, and, and just been a thoroughly enjoyable day. Caps to you and the four racing management team. I think uh, today shows us how much hard work has gone into the day. Well done. Thank you. Appreciate it. All right, there we go. That's Gabby Soma. We're now going to speak to Steve. Come and chat to me. Well done. This is what it's all about. Wow. I'd love Amazing. to know what you were saying at the 200. So I'm surprised you still got a voice. <laughs> well, I, I hardly have a voice. It was absolutely amazing. I, I, uh, I just said, well, you know, let's let the best horse win. I wasn't even looking, and when it got to the last 50 meters, and I looked, wow, this guy is coming flying through here. This is there's a possibility, and it was just unbelievable to see it win. So, uh, and then the most amazing story was, uh, you know, last year we backed number two, we drew number two. This year we drew number two. A lady that was sitting next to me at, at, at dinner said, listen, for the sixth race, back number two, which I did, and it won. And number two won again, so it's four twos in a row. So let's hope the box do it tonight by two. Yep. But yeah, what a phenomenal day. And thanks so much to Allied Steel Road, just an amazing organization. Thank you for the second time inviting us back. It's a great privilege to be here, to the four racing people and to, and to all the, you know, the hardworking staff at SADA, 119 volunteers that we have, our 16 schools and our therapists and our children that are watching. My phone has not stopped uh, since the race has since, since the, the stopped. So it's, Really a pleasure and a, a treasure to be here. Thank you so much. We'll be hoping to see you again next year. I'll definitely be back for sure. <laughs> you don't have to wait for only that race day. You can come and join us whenever you like. I would absolutely do that. Fantastic. Thank you very Thank much. You very much. Mr. Chudder, the man behind this race day is wow. going to hand over 100,000 Rand to Sada. Congratulations to the winning charity. I have no doubt that 100,000 Rand is going to go a long way. That's a great cause. Thank you very much to Steve Lurkey. Continue doing what you're doing for charity and for the underprivileged. Well done. Good stuff. All right, that's how we close it off, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you very much to everybody that's been part of this. Um, I think we've really had a good day. Porto Manzano, just the cherry on the top. To Lawrence Werners, to Johan Janssen van Vieren, to Gavin Larina. Congratulations.